Andre the Giant, another guy I'm thinking of, just an iconic guy of that era. Were you close with Andre at all? Was he friendly? Was he likable? No, Andre he... just kept to himself, you know? You didn't want to mess with Andre. He just wanted to keep to himself. If he talked, he, you know, you respond. But um, he had started getting some health ailments. You could just see in the manner of his walking and... It was very, very hot for him breathing and stuff. So, I uh, no, I uh, I just I just stayed back unless he talked to me. Yeah, because he's he wasn't feeling too good. To put it to you that way. Were those drinking stories about him? Are those true? Or are those a little exaggerated? Uh, that was that was during my time or before my time. But I I don't know. I don't know. I never went out. I know we could put him away though. I bet. <laughs> I know, I know that he used to always get a bottle. Someone would get him a bottle of, like, brandy or something right after the match. He'd probably wolf the whole thing down. He was a drinker. There's no doubt about it. But maybe that was masking the pain because killing him so much. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. And click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Follow us on Twitter at the Hannibal TV for instant updates.